Bitch, please do not ask me what I do. Keep a big 40, but I still might slide you. Smoking big 30 toe L's when we ride through. Niggas big phony on the gram, they be lying to. Keep on talking, so he might not talk no more. That boy scared of these streets. He's down, he's down, he's down. Let's go. What's good, everybody? It's your boy Lace on a case. And today we got some huge updates concerning season three of My Hero Ultra Rumble. Now, for some people, they're probably going to be extremely excited. For others, they're going to feel like it's lackluster. But there is an update. And uh, I want to shout out Sensei Gogo for posting the actual scans of it. Because I didn't have scans. I just had been hearing about it on Twitter. So I thought I'd bring it to the channel. Um, but what we are getting is a Deku new move set. So he's going to be having three different moves integrated into his character, which you can swap between. Um, and those moves are going to be Delaware Smash, Manchester Smash, and Ground Impact. The Ground Impact looked like it was like a shield or some kind of defensive move. And then I'm safely assuming Delaware Smash and Manchester Smash are going to be from the show. Now, with that being somewhat of a positive, they also said that in the middle of the season, they'll be releasing a character. Uh, Sensei Gogo said that he thinks it's going to be the all for one. I'm really hoping that it's twice because those character files were found in the main game. So I'm hoping that it's going to be twice. I think that'd be a really cool addition. But mainly, I just hope we get a villain character because there's not enough in the game. Um, so that's a, another positive. But the negative about this update is that it will, to get the moveset for Deku, it's going to be in the gotcha system. It's not like it's going to be something you can get with tickets or hero souls or another hero ticket to get an alternate version of him you have to roll for it and i know most of the community is probably extremely tired of these roles i really have no justification at this point i used to try and defend it well that's how they got to make money but at this point with how much players they're losing i am very shocked that they decided to go with that option i guess i should say not even option that that the idea of we're going to keep this in the care in the role too. I think it's ridiculous. Every cosmetic is in the role. It's impossible to get cosmetics damn near. Uh, every character that's that's good, you need to roll for. And it's like, even if you guys do variations of a character, we have to roll for that too. I, I Honestly, I think this is very bad for the game. I think all we're going to see is more character more players leaving because it you can't do anything and the crystals it's one thing if you know five to ten dollars will get you a, a, a good amount of rolls but it doesn't it's you know like you can get 10 rolls for 25 dollars this is absurd at this point but i will say i'm very excited for season three and the main reason I'm excited for season three is because of the new map. I think everybody who has who follows them on Twitter understands that the new map is coming and it's going to have the UA school and the mall and who knows what else. It was a very short teaser. I think that their promotion for this whole season has been extremely weird. And it's been odd to me. I feel like they can see the player decrease happening. And I think they're starting to understand that there's little to no way for them to make money with this game at this point um, with the team they have. Um, and I don't want to get on here and just completely bash the game. I love playing the game. I think the gameplay is really fun. I think the character adjustments they've done has been amazing. But when I hear about the Deku variation, I don't think that's enough. You know, you're promoting it six days before and it's just a variation. And most people will not be able to get it without dropping $200 on the game. It's like, bro, <laughs> what are we what are we doing here? Another thing, if you haven't logged in today, when this video has dropped, uh, you should just log in, even if you don't plan on playing today, to get the new Dobby skin. It's a free skin they gave out for uh, the character's birthday. Uh, it's actually a pretty cool skin. Uh, yeah, so make sure you go there and grab that. And let me know in the comments down below who you want to see out of All for One and Twice. I know an overwhelming majority of y'all probably want to see All for One, but I think it would be so cool to have Twice in this game. I think what they can do with his character and with his moveset, I think it could be so dope, man. They could be out here throwing Shadow Clone, basically. Bro, it's going to be tight. I really hope they bring, bring Twice. But yeah, let me know who you want to see or if you feel that there's a reasoning behind why they would actually put someone else in the game. Let me know if you're excited for Season 3. And I think that's going to be it for this video, man. I'll catch y'all in the next one. Peace out. Yankee with the top down and we be shooting block rounds. Play me, you get stopped out. These niggas trying to cop out. Money, I'm always on it. These bitches is always calling. They talking, I'm never bothered. I made it when niggas.